Hey guys, what's going on? So we're going to do some more tone testing today. So I've got this KH2 Purple Sparkle that uh, when I first got it, one of the first things I noticed is I didn't really care for the, the KH Bone Breakers that were in here. Lower gain, not that big a deal, but they were just kind of soft. And I was like, eh, mm, you know, I just like the 81s better. So I did an earlier test where I swapped out those Bone Breakers for this 8185 set, because personally I prefer the 85 uh, up in the neck. That just is what it is. And it's been great. However, playing this guitar in the band, um, the the guitar itself is just, it's kind of a dark and heavy tone guitar. It um, It's great when you're just playing by yourself, but in the band mix, it's just it's a little bit dark. It's got a lot of clarity, you know, so it's not muddy whatsoever. However, it's just dark and it's got a lot of bottom end to it, which, you know, sometimes is actually kind of hard to dial all the way out with your amp. So I'm like, well, you know, I'm going to try some different pickups. And I came across these from a local guy who took him out of a guitar. And I'd, I'd recently played the guitar and I'm like, this guitar is great, but he's not a metal guy and he took him out. So this is a set of... 5766TWs. So this is the, the twin winding uh, 5766 set. So it's got the coil tap on it. I'm like, hmm, let me try them. So we're going to swap them in today and I'm just going to do a riff or a song really where we kind of A, B them so that you can hear the differences in tone. And, uh, you know, there's lots of other clips like that on YouTube for these pickups. But yeah, I... I honestly believe that within nice gear, you know, when you're talking about various higher quality components, there's not really such a thing as good and bad. The issue is finding the combinations of gear that work well together. So, you know, this pickup or that pickup isn't necessarily a good or a bad pickup, but when you combine it with this guitar and this amp, that's when you are trying to chase that magic tone. And so obviously I love 8185 set and they're my favorite and a number of other guitars in this guitar they're really good but i want to try something else to see if maybe i can find a different pickup that is more suited to this specific guitar so if that makes sense so anyway that's what we're going to do today check it out and see what you guys think about the difference in tone later
All right, guys, the job is done. You have heard the tone. And personally, this is exactly what I was hoping for. You know, I obviously love the 8185 and a lot of my other guitars. And this one, it was just a little bit over compressed and had this heavy darkness on the bottom end, which was great in, in the bedroom, but it was just a little bit too much in the band. And so this did exactly what I wanted. Still plenty of gain on these, uh, the 5766, but it uncompressed it a little bit and it just gave it a little bit more clarity and bite and cut, which I think is gonna sit perfectly when I play this thing in the band. So anyway, uh, see what you, I mean, that's what I think. What do you guys think? Because one thing that I've definitely learned over time is that when it comes to tone, everybody hears something different. So check it out. Well, let me know. Later.